yo what's up youtube welcome back to another video hbk all day let's get it man you know what's funny i actually have the my phone set up on like this little branch it's crazy like let me show you real quick that's what i have my phone set up on <laughs> all right let me try to put it back on perfect <laughs> fellas so in this video hopefully the wind doesn't interrupt and it's kind of windy i was just in my car right now but you know i wanted to go outside but <clears throat> right there are things <laughs> Shit. i caught it bro all right i'm gonna film it like this man screw that um so basically okay so <laughs> i look high as shit bro <laughs> i'm not even high bro i'm just freaking you know how it be, man, on retention, you just get those random bursts of of laughter, like, out of nowhere, bro. Um, Y'all see the glow, y'all already know, ready to flow, none of the soul. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, 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 no. Bro, this is crazy, like, I can't even talk right now. Uh, <laughs> basically, never be a people pleaser, okay? That's what I want to talk about, is never be a people pleaser. You never want to put yourself in a position where you're like trying to please other people, but you never take time for yourself. Okay, so this is going to be my little advice for you guys. It's like, yeah, man, never put yourself in a position where where you put people on pedestals. Right. And this especially applies for like content creators, because it's kind of dangerous, you know, when somebody lives their life based on other people's opinions or other people's like basically like somebody like living their life because of uh in a way that somebody else wants to right an example that i could use is well i don't really want to give them a shout out because it's kind of like i feel kind of bad but basically there's like youtubers out there that have kind of like lost themselves in a way because they get like extreme like they blow up like out of nowhere they just blow up and all of a sudden um they just start pe pleasing like their their viewers right like they just kind of start kind of harming themselves or putting themselves in a bad situation just for views and clout and likes and all this stuff that doesn't really matter in the end because why like why gain the world and lose your soul you know and that's true, man. Like, you just got to be focused on yourself, man. And for me personally, like, I'll never be a people pleaser like that. Like, I'm not going to be, like, no dancing monkey for anybody. Um, I'll speak my mind, you know. I'll speak whatever I want to speak. I'm not going to be, like, living my life through another person's perspective, right? And this applies for, like, life in general, man. Like, you, like people, like like, relatives or family members or friends that view you in a certain way which isn't actually you right nobody knows you like you know yourself okay so it's very important to be true to yourself and to not change yourself up for anybody just be authentic okay we live in this fake ass like society where everybody's kind of has like a mask on physically and like mentally right like they just kind of put on a different type of persona to please other people but they're not being authentic. They're not being their self. Um, the thing about retention, man, it just actually brings out like more of you. That's what I noticed, man. Like retention, it makes you more of yourself. Like you don't give a shit, man. Like you're just vibing. Like you're just being yourself. Like you don't have like a filter. You're not like acting like a certain way, like in a in a type of box. Like you're just being like your authentic self man you're being like your soul you're operating more in your spirit and you're not really being like in the ego of trying to like it's all a game man it's, it's kind of like a, a game it's funny it's like the lower self and the higher self um in like how we move out here in society bro it's like kind of crazy it's like so that's why, like, when it comes to, like, social media, like, I don't care about that anymore, guys. Like, I really don't. 
I bear I rarely go on that man it's crazy and the reason for that is because I don't feel like I need like the validation or anything from anyone um you know I just use YouTube just to like share like gems man like these videos are gems and I know it like helps people out and I just try to like share my ideas and things like that but this is one of the things that I want to talk about man is like never be a people pleaser right never put yourself never put somebody over you right the only person that you should put above you is God all right so like when you put other people above you that's when like you lose yourself that's when you lose like a part of yourself because you're trying to live through somebody else's reality all right so that's why when it so you know being a people pleaser will turn you into a robot right it'll turn you into like an npc like you just want to please your followers and like you know there's nothing wrong with that like if you're being authentic and you know you want to bring like good content but i'm saying like there's a thin line between making content that you authentically want to make versus making content just because a group of strangers want you to do that that's when people don't even like want to do the videos they're just making them just for like the like just to please like other people but they're like unhappy as shit you know what i'm saying so also when it comes to like haters man like you can't even take them serious because you know they're secret admirers like they, they're secretly like in love with you <laughs> because you know if somebody watches like somebody just to hate on them like they they love them so much that they're willing to stick around just to emit like that negative energy out onto themselves pretty much because whatever you put out comes back to you okay so um haters are masturbators retainers are innovators <laughs> Peace.